because we are going to talk about what we are going to say. But I want to go back to Ike Kumalo and just find out what his response is to what Ubak Mazibuka had to say. Ike? Let me say this. Uh, somebody mentioned drugs there. You know, uh, are you telling me that the most powerful state in Africa, they are failing to stop drugs? Well, you don't have drug problem in Zimbabwe, in Botswana. Mm. So when the, uh, the wife of a former minister of intelligence was involved in drugs, nobody knew that. Mm. But anyway, I will tell you this. You cannot expect freedom, you know, when you led mm. by traitors. I mean, you have to ask yourself this question, you know, was Sikukuni fighting for civil rights to enter the same toilet with white people? Mm -hmm. Was Ding Iswayo fighting for the same thing? Was Sikukuni uh, and Mampuru, uh, Mushuesho fighting for those things? The ANC is not a liberation movement. You know, it has never been a liberation movement since 1912. It has 100 years of failure. You know, mm -hmm. we've been dispossessed of the land. Mm -hmm. You know, they have never considered that. You know. So for me, I'm not surprised, you know, that the youth are still not free. We will never be free, you know, uh, being led by this guy. That's why I'm saying the youth must take charge, like the youth of 1976, you know. Mm. They forgot about those guys in exile. Most, some of the guys here, uh, they went to exile. As uh, Prasad was saying, that they were smoking cigars there. I mean, you look at uh, the, uh, the statement that was said by Ayanda Lord. Mm. She said that when she went to exile, they were given prevention tablets, mm. you know, which was what, is happen what was happening there. So what, what does you know? it mean? Mm. Were, in exile, my brother, if you can open a can of worms, there were massive rapes, you know, that happened there, you know. But unfortunately, nobody's prepared to talk about that. Guys were not prepared to fight. You mm. know, they were waging an armed arm propaganda. Tell me a, 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 a project, you know, of the MK, or APLA, you know, since 1961 up to now, where we looked as if, or closer to getting liberation, none, oh. you know. Hopefully we'll engage in that, but yeah. thank you so much for coming to our Ike. Thank you Let's find out on Facebook, which I'm talking about, uh, on, on Twitter as well, about the topic. Says, there is nothing that has changed since from 42 years, 22 years. Right. There's nothing. It's just the same horse, different jockey. That's all. Mm. Let me... <laughs> Let me come to you, Ike, uh, on this one. Mm. Um, would you also testify and say, Guti, the youth of uh, 1976 have failed in Youth Guard 2017? Yeah, before I get to that point, when uh, Tumelo speak about uh, people looting, you know, driving Mercedes Benz, yeah. it did not start now. Mm. It started back in exile. Mm. I mean, I can point you towards a big example. Mm. Where was Oliver Tambo? Oliver Tambo was in England. Mm. Here in South Africa, we are fighting British Empire. The leader of a liberation movement, the so-called liberation movement, he goes to sit in London, you know, under the British Empire that you are fighting, riding a Rolls Royce in mm. the most expensive street of London. Mm -hmm. And then you expect that the MK uh, will fight a, a, a just war. It was an unpropaganda. Mm -hmm. You know, guys were looting back in the days, going to United Nations, mm -hmm. you know, uh, going to United mm -hmm. Nations, taking donor money, pretending as if they are fighting, send one guy there and say, mm. how shall I find a baba on with the sevens? And then they looted and looted and looted. Mm. And then we are surprised when they are looting today. Mm. You know, I am saying to you, uh, back in 76, you know, uh, the, the disparities or the differences between the older youth and the, uh, the youth and the parents will mm. always be there. Mm. When the youth were fighting, the parents, uh, there was a slogan that says, as a quail, the parents were going to work. Mm. You know, even today, there'll always be differences, but mm. the youth should not expect the messiahs to come out there. They should lead the struggle because uh, those people, like, you know, who fought in 76 mm. back then, majority mm. of them, they are captured today. Mm. You know, they're into the so called. Hey, not. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Most of them, I heard in the. They, no, no, no. Most of them, they are talking funding. Yes. They are fighting funding and, and yeah. proposals yeah. and all that. Yeah. That's yeah. not the struggle. Mm. I mean, they are going to the very same like Gupta rights guys and say we need funding to do with this, mm. this, mm. to open this and mm. this. Mm. I say to me, uh, to, to 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 everybody else, the youth of of today, mm. you know, they can do so many things. They should look, you know, amongst themselves. One of the solutions that they should do, mm. you know, I'm, I move around in the townships most of the time, yeah. and there's lots of money, like right. you know, people having parties and all that. I say, it, I tell most of the youth mm -hmm. and say, save hundred rand, seven rand. 100 rand all of you during the election year yeah. and take that money and register and vote for a candidate of yourself forget about these politicians mm -hmm. you know in your neighborhood even you know, independent yeah as an independent we're going to come back yeah. to more solutions as well uh, Master Buka. let me come back to you myself I mean,